I don't know, he talked about, it. okay, I got a lot of angry cards and letters from fans and stuff. I mean, what's the difference from him maybe last year than this year, just as a person? I don't know if he's a much different. Same guy. Yeah. Um, gets on us when we're not doing good. Uh, he gets happy. He gets really excited when we're doing things that are good. So he's a great coach, obviously. And, uh, yeah, I don't think there's anything much different that he's been doing. How different is it for you now, who a year ago none of us probably really knew who you were, mm -hmm. and now, you know, uh, you recognize more on campus now? <laughs> uh, maybe a little bit. Uh, yeah. I'm still, I still try and stay Loki. Uh, hopefully yeah. not too many people recognize me or anything like that. But, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it was fun last year, but uh, last year's way in the past, and now we just got to try and get better each and every day. Are you among those who kind of dreams a little bit of if they can get you and Bullock in the backfield together and have that one-two punch that they were never able to last yeah, year? Yeah, definitely, definitely. We have other running backs that can do the same thing too. Yeah. So, yeah, it will be exciting to see what comes from it. Uh, we're doing a little bit now, but – can't wait for the season. Coach Davis was saying last year wasn't a lot of fun for him. Did you see him on a weekly basis? Did uh, could you see it being tough on him when the offense was struggling? Yeah, it's tough on it's tough on all of us. We we're all we we're all all angry about it and knowing that we had better players than we were, than our record was showing. But you know it happens and he's had to move on from it, learn from it. How much of a better grasp do you guys have of this offense now that you've been in it? For a while. Yeah, it's definitely a better guess. The running backs, it wasn't too much of a learning curve, but I know for the receivers and quarterbacks, it definitely was. So, definitely to have another year under our belts is definitely a big thing. Do you feel this is kind of your offense a little bit this year, that it's going to kind of go through you and Damon in the backfield a little bit more than maybe it did last year? Uh, we'll see. You never know. It's all, that's all up to the coaches. I can't, I, I don't know what's going on in their minds, but uh, yeah, we have we have good, great running backs, we have good quarterbacks fighting for a job, great receivers, so it's just we got to all feed off each other. The run game and the pass game has to feed off each other for yeah. it to both work. And uh, like you said, feeding off each other, do you think the pass game is going to go a little bit through the run game this year, that the run will set up the pass a little bit more? I think it's got to both. They both have to set up each other and definitely play action pass is a big part of Iowa football, and, you know, we got to bring it back. And what are the, some of the different places that uh, the coaches have maybe moved you around this spring or to try and get you and Damon incorporated into the offense at the same time? Yeah, we're uh, I'm trying to want to play a little fullback and running back, Damon to play a little running back and receiver, so we'll see how it works. Uh, we've done it a little bit, and um, uh, hopefully we continue to do it. And uh, Coach White talked about some of the things that he was working on with you, trying to make you into kind of an all-around back. Can you talk mm -hmm. about some of the work you've done with him? Yeah, we're just trying to maybe not have two hands on the ball. You don't have a base and you don't have a uh, balance, so you want to get that one hand on the ball stiff arm maybe make one cut and then get them on their toes a little bit so uh, making me more of a dynamic running back than just a bruiser in there so we'll see how it works out it's obviously, going good I'm sorry obviously yeah. injuries were a factor last year but can you put a finger on what happened to the offense you know it just it's, it's hard to put a finger on it it really is uh if we had injuries that's no excuse so we just we just weren't clicking we weren't consistent that was the biggest thing we showed signs that we could do it but we definitely were consistent that's what we're working on being consistent